Real free news. Extra. Extra. Tuck is actually talking with Lil Black Iced Cupcake and actually listening to the answers as if this knucklehead has something to say. I wouldn't have expected that. Why, why do you think that is? Everybody wants you to be in your little hole. Everybody wants you to, to uh, stay in your lane and all that stupid stuff. Iced Cupcake is a mental midget and stage stooge who got lucky singing songs and repeating the lyrics bitch, f and over and over. The only reason this fake gangsta got famous is because white kids thought this clown and his lyrics were funny and bought his albums. It's funny hearing a Lil Black poser punk say bitch, f and <laughs> Tuck notices that Lil Black Iced Cupcake hasn't discussed race in this Lil Softball interview. Do you think that we overplay the role of racial conflict in American life? Yes. I think race, it, it takes up too much space. The reason Iced Cupcake doesn't bring up race is because he hates white people and has sung songs about killing white people. But, he has to sell his Lil songs to white people. He has to sell his terrible movies to white people. He has to sell tickets to his lazy black skipball show to white people. The truth is that, Iced Cupcake owes everything he has to white folk and this Lil fake gangsta wannabe tough guy hates that fact. If white people didn't buy their garbage, then they'd be making minimum wage at El Polo Loco. So, it's not about race. Tuck admits he doesn't listen to Black Iced Cupcake songs, and then the fake gangsta makes a startling admission about rappers. I've never been a big hip hop fan, but I've met a you know bunch of hip hop performers. Rappers, you know, we're free spirits uh, for the most part. Iced Cupcake calls himself a free spirit. No, you are a joke that got lucky singing songs about whack bitches, robbing liquor stores, and shooting up the hood. We know doing things. The way they were done in the past hasn't really gotten us as far along as the people as, as we have wanted. What Iced Cupcake means is that singing songs about bitches, robbing, and shooting, and then selling that garbage to white kids has made the little fake gangsta rich and famous, but the wannabe tough guy has to act like a victim and cry about all the oppression that the bad actor has to face. What a joke. <laughs> Tuck continues his softball patty cake kumbaya with black diced cupcake and acts the foul mouth flunky about his acting a fool. Does feel like there's more of that, doesn't there? Yeah, it seems like it's uh it's like you're stuck in a bad movie and you can't get out. Like you can't find an exit and it continues to play on the screen and you're just running around looking for the exit and this bad movie continues to just haunt you. Day by day by day by day, you know, that's what we're calling it. Iced Cupcake tried to act in his own movies where the bad actor and mumble mouth mutthead displayed his inability to act as any other character other than the unconvincing wannabe tough guy and real dim-witted dummy. Um, Tuck sat down with Black Diced Cupcake for a softball interview. You supposed to dance with the person you brought. Yeah. yeah. And the person that, that, that brought you to the dance you guys are supposed to dance together. Why didn't Tuck ask any real questions to the wannabe tough guy who dresses up in little gangster costumes and sings songs about killing white people? Ice Cupcake has a song called I Wanna Kill Sam where he sings about killing white Americans. Why didn't Tucker ask about that song? Is Tuck scared of fake gangstas? Seems that way. <laughs> Tucker Carlson had a sit down patty cake puff piece with wannabe tough guy and real bad actor, Black Dice Cuckoo. So why would you be doing this of all interviews? I mean, you could do an interview with anyone, you're doing an interview with me. Um, because I think it's silly. Um, I think, you know, it's like, this is what it's all about. Let's, let's talk about it. Let's, let's debate and, and, <laughs> so to speak. So, um, and so, um, I've been, um, um, so, uh, what, when I've, you know, I'm not, you know, I don't, I don't follow their, um, no, you're not. Yeah, I don't know what it is, but, uh, and, and, um, I really don't know. You know, that's, that's something that I would love to find out. But I, I don't, I can't tell you, you know, if there's a single thing that I've done or Black Dice Cuckoo tries to talk, but is unable to form a sentence or put more than two coherent words together without swearing. He is trying to act like a nice guy in order to sell more of his fake gangsta garbage to Tucker's audience. Cuckoo knows Tucker's audience doesn't want to hear f 
will bitch every other word, so he is trying to speak without using profanity. When Cuckoo tries to talk normally, he doesn't have anything to say, but gibberish. Um, extra. 